In today's video, I will show you how to upload a Node.js app completely for free using a service called Render. So this is my basic Node.js app. And if I go to the homepage, you can see that I'll see the result saying hello from your Express server. So to start, the first thing we want to do is to go to this website, render.com. Once you're on this page, just sign up for an account or log in if you already have one. Then we can click on dashboard, click on the new button, click on web service. On this page, we just need to connect the repo that we want to host. Since I've logged in using my GitHub account, these are all the repos that I let Render have access to. So you would just need to connect your repo depending on how you set up your account. But since I'm using GitHub, I can just click on this configure account button here. Once I'm on this page, I can select all the repos that has access to. So in this case, I'm going to select one more repo and it will just be my Node.js app that I just showed earlier. And I'll hit save. Now you can see here the repo that I just connected. So I will click on connect. Now we just have to name it. So I'll just name it Node Express app. For the region, just select the closest region to you out of this list. Select the branch that you want to deploy. Specify your root directory. For runtime, just make sure it says Node. For the build command, just type in the command that you need to actually build your app. I'm just going to do npm install. For the start command, just type in the specific start command that you need to use to start your app. In my case, it would just be node index.js because that's the name of my file. Then if we scroll down, we can see the different type of instant types that we can select. Just select the free tier for now and then scroll down and click on create web service. I will resume this video once this is done being uploaded. The build has now successfully completed. And if we click on a link that render generated for us, we can now see the exact same message that we saw from earlier, letting us know that the Node.js app is working correctly. And that's the end of this Node.js app hosting tutorial. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please like the video and don't forget to subscribe for more content.